Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to another song review. Today we're going to be listening to Wild Love Died by Northward. And this is a combination of Floor Jansen and Jorn Vigo Lofstad. I hope I said that right. This was a winner of last week's poll. I will pop it in here. And I was a little surprised. Um, my husband and I were talking about this and he's like, well, obviously if you put Floor in any poll, it's going to dominate. And Part of me thought that, but then I took the time and I was like, okay, I'm going to pick some good competition for this. And Sabaton is close behind, I will say. So I feel like I have to do that one somewhat soon. I'll, I'll put it on the calendar for maybe next month sometime. I'm making a lot of promises, just throwing things out, but I feel like I need to do it since it's that close. I thought, okay, throw some Sabaton in, throw some Pantera in, and... I put in Bring Me the Horizon featuring Baby Metal, but it's Baby Metal. You know, maybe I should have just did Baby Metal by themselves. But again, these are all songs I want to check out too. But today is going to be Northward. And I wore my Nightwish shirt in support of this decision that we all made together. So let's pop our headphones on, turn it up, and here we go. We fuck hatred through the things we didn't say I guess honesty sometimes really breaks things up Me, like, 
like Rage Against the Machine guitar vibes. Very cool. Another one started playing. That was really good. I love that. Like, like I've said before, I'm kind of new to the more heavier metal scene. This is kind of about as intense as I got before I got into heavier stuff. So it's very familiar. It's like a familiar sound to me and I really like it. I love the sass. So while I was paying attention to the lyrics, I always like to look over them another time before I give my thoughts on it. And this website here, radio.callmefred.com. I find such weird websites. I don't, I don't know how, but they said the lyrics are about a complicated and tumultuous relationship. The protagonist and their partner have a love hate dynamic and struggle with honesty. The protagonist wonders if things would be better if they could let go of their pride and if their love turning black would be mourned and a different path would be taken, which I think it's kind of obvious from the lyrics, but I love those kind of love songs, I guess. I guess it's considered a love song. I don't like the mushy, oh, I don't know how to describe it, but I don't like the mushy lovey-dovey songs about love. I like the dark stuff. I like the angry stuff. I don't know what that says about me, but I am not a like a typical love song person. So this kind of stuff I just think is very fun and like I said, dark, but also kind of punky at the same time and just very fun. They're a good combo and Yorn, I believe is how you say it. He is so awesome at guitar. I want to hear more from, I mean, even Penguin's Mind and this, I, I definitely want to listen to more from them. I don't even know when they, when this happened. Let me see. I think it was 2018, if I remember right. So they created the project in 2007, wrote an entire album worth of music in 2008, but being unable to record it due to label issues and their busy schedules, they ultimately reunited in 2017 to record the album. So I'm assuming that's when the video came out, right? Yeah, the video says it was posted August 28th, 2018. So that's cool. Yeah, oh my gosh. All this stuff that just stems from like one band or like one video, you know, at a time. And then people are like, check this out. You should check this out. And I love it so much. I know I say it quite often, but I really do. And I want you guys to know that I appreciate you watching and leaving suggestions because this, this is super fun to me. And I hope you guys are having fun too, discovering new bands because this one I've, well, when it comes to Floor, obviously we've done Nightwish and Revamp. I did a couple of those songs, I think, maybe two. And I did some Floor on her own, but this one was new to me. And possibly aside from Nightwish, this is probably my favorite that I've heard. I like the punky spunkiness to it. That, that's where I'll leave it. You guys let me know what you thought of this one and let me know if I should check out more by them. Uh, maybe I will do it on a Friday so it doesn't dominate the poll again because <laughs> we all know it will. But I look forward to chatting about this one in the comments with you guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye!